Okay, everybody, I'm ready to to paint this uh, scenery here. Hello, everyone. I'm Henry Lee. Um, hello, everybody here with the PVAC art, uh, workshop at the Palace Verde Art Center. Um, today is Sunday, August 17th. We have very nice weather here. Um, we're going to do a outdoor sketching. Later we'll try to do a painting based on the inspiration here. Behind me is the inspiration point and the, the sacred bay you cannot really see. Um, and there's some um, another it's uh, the Portuguese cove or the I think the Avarani Cove, okay. And uh, in distance we can see the Canela Island in the midst of Hayes, what do you call it? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, actually, I can see many boats. That's not uh, expected uh, from many pictures I've seen. The the sailing boat. Um, that's very, very, very good for painting. And uh, then along the other color, the everything. Because in Chinese painting, we use ink. So uh, we'll try to paint a mind image um, with the inspiration. This natural scene. It, uh, it's so dramatic that the mountain here, you feel, uh, when I see the picture, I didn't feel the height. But here I can really feel the, uh, the mountain, you know. Mm -hmm. it, it's only 200 from the sea level, I think, but it is very difficult to climb. I guess it will take a day to, to the sea, I guess, um, if you hike. So it's high mountain and uh, flowing water, <laughs> the scene. And we're going to do, uh, I try to do this high mountain. So that's the idea. We have to develop an idea first. The so high mountain, flowing water, is what in my mind try to uh, convey. So I try to, first of all, make this mountain high. We parked a uh, very, far from here, but I can see this the location from um, on the street, you know, I can feel this height. So that's where I will start with the foreground. So I paint not only uh, from my viewpoint here, I start from where I park. Okay. You understand? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Brush, uh, water brush. I may use. Try to hold it in one hand. Can we hold it? Uh, hold. Thank you. I mean, it's a little windy, so mm. I have to struggle a little bit. First of all, I would do this. Uh, uh, what do you call this? A grand uh, or out outlook? What is this? Look out. Or, uh, lookout. Lookout. Yeah. At uh, <laughs> Del Cerro, right? Del Cerro Park. Del Cerro Park. Del yes. Cerro Park is a natural reserve uh, because the land is so active in, in movement mm -hmm. all the time. time. So uh, you cannot build buildings in this uh, area. That's why they put in uh, a park. So I try to indicate this uh, feeling of uh, mountain meet the sea. This is the, 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 the mountain we are at. Okay. And, uh, this is the outlook. The painter artist here drawing. Uh, <laughs> very small, mm -hmm. as you can see. Okay. You can put more details later, but uh, uh, I try to just record the the things that we cannot catch with our camera. Mm. Okay, so you, you you imagine you're in the uh, sky, and then uh, this uh, inspiration curve could be here. 
Um, but the, actually, the, the skyline is there, so I would do this uh, first. The, what do you call this uh, horizon? With the Kalina Island. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. That's basically, um, we call this opening and close in Chinese composition. You understand? Okay. Opening that goes up, close that, that stop it. Okay. The sky, the earth and the sky, yin and yang. Okay? That's basically the picture. <laughs> so you can add more, um, like a, a boat. <laughs> the sailing boat, beautiful. There's a steamer, or, or, or no, I don't have a great call to see. Motorboat. Motorboat. Fishing boat. We need a big container ship. Yeah. 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 <laughs> container ship. Someone yeah. earlier today. Not on Sunday. Yeah. Well, we can just yeah. do another ancient style. Um, we, we, we try to paint what the ancient, will, you know, our ancestors will see. <laughs> so we just do a. Small boat, fishing boat, and there may be a fish man there. And uh, you know, you can, you can, you can, um, you can add more things uh, if we have space. But uh, just you know, to keep it simple, this is how uh, we should, you know, we try to record. to do this little, mm -hmm. what do you call this, uh, rock, mm -hmm. this uh, wave, a little water. So in, in Chinese painting, we um, describe the landscape as beautiful as, as uh, painting. We don't say the painting is beautiful as landscape. You know what what comes first, right? So the beautiful painting is in your mind. So if the landscape meet our expectation and our imagination, that's why they're beautiful. You know. So we we try to highlight that. We try to express that in our painting. That's what we do. That's it. Okay. Where would you draw this? Uh Oh, this this sea line. In that picture. In this picture, um, let's do that. <laughs> Good question. I like challenges. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I just use lighter ink to draw a second, uh, like the sea line. Yeah, with the abalone coat. Abalone like coat. Yeah. I, I already have some here, so if we, should, we can draw uh, just a little. La a little other layer like this, you know, like the some seashore. You know, you can you can do another layer. So this become a harbor. But this fisherman is uh, going out, or coming back. And you have to use the different tones to distinguish the. Right, so this, kind of, this is the first the foreground. So I'm not cleaning up my brush. I don't need to use paper towel. <laughs> okay. The brush is clean. Is that what uh, you are saying? Thank you. That's another layer. Yeah. If I had bigger painting, I can paint to longer. <laughs> yeah, or this way. Uh, depends on you know the. Base. Uh -huh. um, oh, you can paint uh, on the second page to continue this side, or maybe uh, just to, to paint uh, the other side of the this uh, this canyon. Right? What do you see in this picture? 
Okay. I see a lot of cliffs and there's a lot of movement with the lines, a lot of rapid strokes. And the paint, the, ice, the ink looks like it's just falling down into the ocean with some nice calm horizontal um, land on the background and then one tiny little island maybe in the middle. But overall, there's a lot of movement and a lot of activity. Can you recognize the location? Do you think it's a that reflective spirit here? That probably is some sort of an island, like maybe that's Catalina Island. The, and then the, over yeah. here on the left side. Yeah. Where, where we are? Can we you see are, it in the picture? I think this is Abalone Cove right there. Uh -huh. And definitely that's where the beach is yeah. hitting the... Yeah, I was the, this is the panther right there. So we were also in the picture. You are in there? We are in here? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that's the idea. So I started where I park on the street. You started and then you continue painting yeah. as you I, In went. my mind. I painted oh, in my fun. mind. Yeah. So it's like a working in progress paint. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. it captures many more many moments yeah in the first moment I didn't see the Kalina Island until I reached the summit uh -huh. but uh, uh, we, we have we, we can see this height where we are from this outlook lookout um, then I added the island and into the picture it. to complete it but there's a separate one yeah so, the, you're, so in, in this kind of painting the viewpoint moves as you mm -hmm. walk it's a work in progress painting. Yes, yeah, work in progress. And then when do you know when, when you're done? When it feels Any right? Anytime. <laughs> when it feels right. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you next stuff. I'll see you in the cast.